Hello, everyone. So, I just had a wonderful bath with Epsom salts and essential oils in it. And then I was going to do my makeup. And then I thought, wait, let's videotape me doing my makeup so you can see what I do. So I was trying to get close enough, but far enough away so you can see. So I hope this is okay. We'll see. We'll just do it. Anyway, and it gives us a chance to just chat, right? So I am still a little bit pinky. That's, that's, that's my uh, pale, pasty white skin of mine. Um, so I'm a little bit red still from the hot, hot bath. Oh, it was awesome. I was reading my book. It was a wonderful thing. Um, so I got it all set out here in front of me. Um, so I'll show you the bits as I go. Today, I'm just wearing, I don't need to wear my makeup all day, all day, all night. Um, so this, uh, what's it called? Magnifying primer. It's a primer. I don't really need it, but I'll show it to you because yeah, it's, it's awesome. It works. I, I'm not a makeup person. I normally don't wear makeup every day. Uh, I just wear it every once in a while. So usually when I do wear it, I need it to look good and I need it to last. Uh, so literally, I'm going to say that a lot, literally, like itsy bitsy teeny weeny. How can I? There, right? Itsy bitsy teeny weeny. That's all it takes. And we'll do my whole face, right? So on my gentle fingers, right? Right? Mm -mm, mm -mm. I can still feel it. It's funny. It's just an itsy bitsy teeny weeny. And I wanted you to hear me good, so I put the earbuds on. So it looks weird putting makeup on with earbuds on. <coughs> oh, tickle in my throat. So foundation. People often ask me, well, you know, colors, warm, cool, blah, blah, blah. I don't know. We. This is probably the second lightest. And I have it in a cool tone. I've also worn a warm tone, but that's mostly in the summer. Um, this is a powder. There is liquid. Um, what is this? Foundation. And in the same colors, right? So if you prefer liquid, there's liquid. If, and if you like the powder, you, you get the powder. I like the powder because this is all I do. Right? Because there's holes in there. So I just put a bunch in there and if I need more, I add more. That's it, right? I have a fancy foundation brush. So I got my little thing here. And because it's a powder, this is, what do they even call this? Misting spray. I always say lock the cap back on because I find that um, the spray nozzle doesn't get clogged up as much. Right? Actually, this one hasn't at all. And it's, you just get it a little bit wet, two or three. Usually I run it on my tummy uh, because I'm standing in front of the mirror in my bra when I'm putting makeup on. Uh, but I'm not today. So this is all I do is I take my semi white, bra white, semi wet brush, foundation brush, and I'm just going to kind of like mm, 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 mm. sometimes make a little paste ish right it's hard for me to see and show you at the same time and then i'm just gonna go in circles and sometimes it's hard to when i'm putting it on that i i'm like i don't know is it even doing anything <laughs> but once i put the blush on and finish up all the stuff yeah, then I see it. I'm like, oh, yeah, there's foundation on there. Sometimes, right, usually right here, it gets cakey. And that's just because of the dry ratio, blah, blah, blah. So I usually just give it a rub if it gets a little cakey. I'm going to do my... And this is just to even out your skin tones if you don't know anything about makeup. Just even out your skin tones. Like, even though I still have the red bits from my bath they're harder to see right and you just keep adding until you're happy 
my little red nose. I think that's just the water, the hot water. Anyway, so there it is, foundation. Evening out my skin tones. Ba 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 ba. Um two things, I guess. So in the summertime, I use the bronzer. Like, look at that color. Mint, there's different colors of bronzers too. Maybe I'll open up and show you a better color. See? Right? So I'll use the bronzer in the um, in the summertime. But other people do the, the contouring, right? They'll use a bronzer for contouring. Uh, I, I'm just trying to make myself look presentable today. This is what's happening. And so then I have blush, right? Let's see if we can get you a good, right? Many different colors. There's so many colors. I got, an eye, I got a hair in my eyelashes. And same thing, bum, 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 bum. I just put in a tiny bit, a tiny bit. Like this, um, trying to think, different brush. I gotta use the, look at that. And we spray it. I usually just spray it one side, one side. Give it a little, right? Um, I had a wee jar, I think, a smaller jar than the other one and I think that lasted me more than a year so you don't need very much at all that seems to be a quite the um saying in young living is you just need a little bit <laughs> a little bit will do ya like look at that my brush is a little bit wet but and then I just do a little blending right See, now it looks like I'm wearing foundation. And you can do the little, right? Yeah, so itsy bitsy teeny weeny. That's all you need is blush. Um, I was going to say, like, I could probably give you a list of things that aren't in it or things that are in this Savvy Mineral makeup line that is not in it. Like, it's not tested on animals. There's no gunk in there, no parabens, no, no nasty stuff. It's just all natural. Like if I had to put this on my toddler grandchild, I would be okay doing that because there's nothing in it but natural goodness, mineral goodness. It's actually good for your skin. Um, yeah. So that's why I like it. And I don't mind if I, ha if I put it on. It's not a big deal. I... Um, shadow, see, not a makeup girl, don't know. I have, but I have a ton of it. <laughs> so I got these that are individual colors, right? Very pretty, very pretty. I'm going to use this one today, I think. Um, I also have in a kit, I just got to remove the plastic. Bum, bum, bum. So you can actually see I use this stuff, right? This one is like a black matte color no it's got some shine on it it's black sometimes I will use my I'm trying to get my handy dandy I'll show you in a minute my case this is um an eyeliner tool and it's got a special little thing there so this one I did buy separately I probably use my points but anyway I can and have used this black um, as an eyeliner Right, doot, 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 doot. you can add a little bit of the misting spray onto your if you want it to look like more dramatic. So you can do that too. Um, and then I had to buy this one because, and I'll show you because it's awesome. Um, I went to beauty school once, and I'm like, can you give me some eyebrows? Like, look at those colors. And so she, so when I talked to the, um, um, the big guru, um, I said, look at me, like, what color do I need to give myself eyebrows? So it's this little brown color here. And she showed me how to, how to give myself eyebrows. Now I'm not getting that fancy today. If I was going out, I would totally do like dramatic eyes or smoky eyes, give myself some eyebrows, some, some eyeliner, totally do that too. 
but I'm just going to give myself a little shine, a little sparkle, make myself feel special, right? So I'm just going to use this, this plain, um, oh, I used it all. So this is a new one. <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, uh. Oh my goodness. Maybe I won't use this. I don't have any fingernails right now. There we go. So, and just tiny, tiny, like, uh, right? Uh, your choice if you want to, um, what is this brush? That's a blending one. It didn't look right. There's my eye brush, my eyeshadow brush. So it's just boop, 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 boop. Again, you can use your misting spray if you want a more dramatic look. And I look, I'm so far away. So I'm just going to give myself a shiny little, right? Yeah. If you're interested in um, what's in the products, what's not in the products, uh, Young Living has their own website and it's called Seed to Seal. And it kind of explains their philosophy uh, about how they actually, they look after the dirt. It all starts with dirt, um, dirt, seeds, um, the farms, the, how they distill it, the storage, there's uh, double the amount of testing that happens. And sometimes when you're working on your eyeballs, you have to stop talking. <laughs> yeah, so Seed to Seal is like, seedtoseal.com is totally amazing. And um, yeah, like it's, I, I'm trying to even remember, I think it's like 20 years. Like you cannot plant things, you cannot be a young living farm if for 20 years, that's how long it needs to be free of pesticides, right? So they're really looking after the dirt. That's how I feel so confident that this stuff is good for me and good for my skin. Seed to seal, baby. Okay, we got, before I do my eyelashes, it's going to be dramatic. Um, there's a veil right? So, and I think there's a couple of different kinds. This one's the shiny one. There's a matte one as well. And well, that's a lot. That's a lot, but that's okay. Um, and I got a big brush. I love my brush. It's so soft. Um, and literally you put a little bit on, I don't have my sink tap. Give it a tap, right? Get rid of the excess. And then you're just gonna. I have a blending brush, so if you had more than one um, eye color on, then you can do that, right? So that just push, boom. I got sparkles, baby. I got sparkles. There we go. Okay, so now mascara. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. So. Mascara and me usually don't get along. It's been a lifelong battle, let me tell you. Um, and then, and for the longest time, Young Living, Young Living did not have a mascara. Uh, and then they got one. And it was awesome. I loved it. I loved it so much. They came out with two other kinds. And I'm like, I'm not switching. I'm using. And this is why I wasn't good with mascara is because... I would put mascara on and then I would get that black under my eyes. It was, I, I don't even know. I don't even know. But you can see or not see. <laughs> I don't have very big eyelashes. And I'm blonde too, right? So it's like, what? So you can kind of see how short they are, right? Yeah. But then I felt like splurging and I was going to spend some of my loyalty points and I bought myself long lash mascara, right? So I'm gonna do one, and yes, I'm gonna look funny. I need to get closer though, because I need to see. Right? Here we go, people. Yeah. Oh, you can see it already, right? You can see my eyelashes. 
I have no... I'm just kind of guessing muscle memory. Uh, I do my bottom ones because you, they're so thin. Like, look. Who knew I had eyelashes, people? It's amazing. Like, this was truly amazing, and then this went magic. It went magical. So if you have long, luscious eyelashes, naturally, um, you should maybe try this because you may not have to wear fake eyelashes. What do you think? It's awesome. I love it. I'm never going back. Like, I don't know what he did over there, but. <laughs> well, I got eyelashes. Well, let me tell you. Okay, lips, last thing on the list, right? Um, so they do have some, you can see those colors there, right? Mm -mm 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 -mm. This is really pretty. Um, and this one is more neutral. So sometimes I get, um, so that's lipstick and there's lip gloss, right? So I will, sometimes if I put the darker lip, I mean, I'll just put the darker one on and you can see it, right? So I'll put the darker one on or I'll put a light lipstick on and then put a dark pink or purple gloss on. But this one, so sometimes, mm, 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 mm. I may screw this up. And it lasts, yeah. And it's all natural. Like, so you know how they say, oh, and women, 80% of the red dye comes from their lipstick. Uh, I was, when I wear lipstick, I think I look like my grandmother. Um, I got her lips. Um, yeah, there's nothing crappy in here. Eat away, ladies, eat away. So then, so I have this bold lip, right? And I just wanna make it a little bit shinier and maybe tone it down a little bit. I think this is a brand new bottle. Anyway. All right, it just, look at the difference. Mm. It's awesome. There we go. I am set and ready to go. Yeah. So check it out. Seed to Seal. You got questions uh, about uh, what, whatever I talked about because I don't even know what I talked about. Oh, I was going to show you. Wait one minute. Don't go yet. Don't go yet. So remember I was talking about my brushes. So it comes in this fancy, fancy case. Um, there's a little pack that goes in it as well. So that's where I usually put my... my um, um, foundation and, and stuff. Everything goes in there. Uh, and then it can snap in. But look at this. That's where the brushes are. So the, so the only one that didn't come with it is the, the eyeliner one. I paid, I got that one separately and it's beautiful. I just, and it just goes in my bathroom drawer. I take it out. I usually have this in there and my spray just because I'm going to need that. Right. So it all goes in there. And then all my colors and my uh, luscious long lashes are in my other black case. So I've got two cases. I have all my makeup. Easy peasy, my friends. Easy peasy. Okay. Now, on to the next thing, right? Okay. Have a wonderful day. Uh, if you want more um, information about stuff, uh, I've got a group on Facebook that's completely free. You're welcome to join. And everybody's there, right? So, yeah, it is. I'll put it in the comment. I'll put it in the little description there. So there's a little link, and you don't even have to know the name of it. You just push it and say, hey, what's going on, Don? Right? All right. So peace, and uh, we'll be chatting with you soon.